Hello and welcome to Storybook Azeroth, where we adventure through some of the greatest stories in World of Warcraft. In this continuation of the epic Wrathgate narrative, the time has come to follow High Lord Fordragon to the long-awaited assault on the Wrathgate. Greetings. Now you can see why they call this the Dragon Wastes. Bones of the beasts are strewn about as far as the eye can see. We've probably taken down a dozen or more Frostworms and there's still no end in sight. The Scourge has got fuel for 10,000 more with all the bones lying about. Turalyon clears his throat. I don't mean to bore you with the details, hero. We've got the worm you're looking for locked on our sights. Your frost worm is out there, Turalyon points west, and it's a big one. When you're ready to fight, go speak to Wormbait. He'll fetch her. Once Ice Storm is close enough, we'll chain her to the ground and finish her off. Hopefully, with your help, we'll be able to take her down and get you that phylactery. Once you've got the phylactery, return to Wormguard Keep and report to High Commander Halford Wormbane. He has been making preparations for the final showdown with Thelzon. Light bless you. Well met. Wormbane, eh? Welp, go fetch us Ice Storm. Go with honor, friend. I'll flesh her out, Oksana. You just be ready for her when she comes. Fire! Fire! Bring her down! Thelzon's phylactery falls to the ground below Ice Storm. Thanks to your heroics, Lord Fordragon has given the command to launch a full assault against Thelzon. Seventh Legion have made their way to the summoning chamber of the mausoleum and located what appears to be a gateway to hell. The only piece that's missing now is you. Take the phylactery and report to Legion Commander Yorick inside the Winterguard Mausoleum. There's a tunnel that the Scourge dug just outside the keep that you can take to get to Yorick quickly. Go now, Oksana. Lead us to victory. What can I do for you? Yorick lets out a sigh of relief. We thought you might not show up, Oksana. Life bless you. When you're ready, I'll place the phylactery out in front of the gateway and call forth Thelzon. Be careful. Every good story has a beginning and an ending, Oksana. While your story is far from over, I'll be damned if it's not already turning out to be the stuff of legend. No matter what happens to us when this is all over, what you've done at Winterguard will be a tale told for years to come. Now, ally, when you're ready, I will use the phylactery to coax Thelzon out of hiding. Should we somehow succeed, report the victory to High Commander Halford Wormbane at Wormguard Keep. Light bless you. Steal yourselves, soldiers. Oksana has provided us with the final piece of this puzzle. The Dread Lich Thelzon will soon come out of hiding, only to be rendered powerless against us. It is this phylactery, Thelzon's phylactery, that is the key to victory. I was once like you, mortal, soft, only flesh and bone, weak and timid. Legion, steady yourselves. Our Lord Arthas saw in me the frailty of man. Serve me in life, and I will promise to rend the weakness from your soul, to erase it from existence, to be chosen, to be blessed by the Lich King in such a way. So serve him I did. Were it not for me, the glorious dread citadel of Naxxramas may never have returned to Northren. But enough talk. You have fought hard and come from distant reaches of this world to face the Duskbringer. I shall not disappoint. Just as our lord saved me, so too shall I save you. Courage, honor, compassion, and justice. 
These were once the virtues you fought for as a cleric of the Argent Dawn, Thelzon. You dedicated your life to fighting the Scourge. You saw what they did to our beloved Lordaeron. The Lich King took everything from you. So how, then, did Father Inigo Montoy, bastion of virtue for the Argent Dawn, become the embodiment of that which he hated most? This will be the last time you utter that name, Paladin. Breathe your dying breath. Rise, my minions. Your master commands it. Here. Now be free and join the battle. Let us end this together. Victory for the Alliance! You have saved Winterguard. With Thelzon's filth washed away, the Seventh Legion will easily clean up the remaining Scourge. When you are done here, report to Agrathar. Winterguard is saved because of you, Oksana. To think that one woman could so swiftly turn the tides of battle is hard for most to comprehend. Yet here we are, victorious. You have managed to restore the faith of these people and earned the respect of your commanding officers. Lord Vordragon has returned to Agrathar to prepare our forces for the destruction of the Wrathgate and has requested that you join him. I couldn't recommend a better soldier for the job, Oksana. With the Nax Ramus war machine stopped dead in its tracks, the time has come for you to help our forces at Agrathar, the Wrathgate. Nestled against the mountain in Northern Dragonblight is our base of operations, Four Dragon Hold. It is there that Lord Four Dragon awaits your arrival. Go now, Oksana. Take the North Gate out of town and travel north by northwest until you arrive at your destination. Light protect you. Light be with you. This commendation is only given to those who have gone above and beyond the call of duty in the name of the Alliance. I could count the number of times I've given this one out on one hand, Oksana, and never has anyone been more deserving than you. Congratulations. Now, let us look upon the Wrathgate. Does it look familiar? It should. That strange ore that you found at the Winterguard Mine is exactly what the Wrathgate is made from. We will find its weakness and expose it for all to see. First, though... Our assault against Agrathar has staggered the Scourge, but they remain unrelenting. From overhead, they send their Frostworms to strafe the field of battle, making advance upon the gate itself impossible. The Frostworm attacks must be stopped, but before we defile the bones of ancient dragons, we must gain permission from their queen. Travel southeast to the Wormrest Temple and seek out Queen Alexstrasza. Tell her of what we must do and ask for her guidance. Go now, Oksana. Stand tall. You have come seeking my counsel, mortal. This I know, but do you know what it is that you face? Alexstrasza points northward. North of here are the dying grounds of Galakrond, progenitor of dragonkind. It is from Galakrond that the Titans created the Aspects. Imagine then the power of Galakrond. His size alone was greater than all of the aspects combined. Now attempt to understand what the Scourge do in Great Dragonblight. Frostworms, mortal, should be the least of your concerns. From atop the Wicked Coil, the Grand Necrolord of the Scourge, Antioch, sits upon the shoulders of the reconstructed Storm Giant Lord Thassily. From there he commands armies of undead to work day and night to unearth Galakrond's massive bones. Should they succeed in raising Galakrond, all your efforts will have been for naught. Well, I cannot call down the full fury of the Red Dragonflight to assist you in your journey. I will grant you my blessing. Go now and speak with my Major Dormu, Torestraza. The bravery of mortals never fails to astound me. Death affixes its cold stare upon you, and in return you rise to challenge its assertion. It is why your kind is so loved, and so hated. 
Even though the Red Dragonflight is entrenched in a war with Malagos, there is something we can do to help. Use this beacon to signal a Wormrest Vanquisher. Climb upon its back and fly north to Galakron's Rest. Once there, command the dragon to destroy the Scourge Scavengers that work to unearth Galakron. Once the area has been cleansed, fly to the Wicked Coil overlooking Galakron's Rest to destroy Grand Necrolord Antioch and recover the scythe he uses to control the worms. Do this and return to Queen Alexstrasza for a hero's reward. Oksana, beware of the rotting storm giants that wander the area. Soon the bones of Galakrond will rise from their eternal slumber and wreak havoc upon this world. You think you've won, mortal? Face the unbridled power of Antioch! Behold! The Scythe of Antioch! The Scythe of Antioch drops to the ground. Be well. I knew that you would return, Oksana. You have served the Wormrest Accord and saved your people from certain death. Let it be known to all and let it be recorded for posterity. Stand tall. With Antioch slain and the scythe in our possession, the Frostworm assaults upon your forces at Agrathar will halt. The worms that remain in Dragonblight will be hunted and destroyed, their bones returning to the earth. The time to make your final stand is now, Oksana. Return to Four Dragon Hole and notify High Lord Four Dragon. Need help? Know this: all that you have done has led to this moment. Without your efforts, we would have been finished. Now stand guard as I take to the field and end this. You've stolen, traitor! Boldly stated, but there is nothing you can. What? 
Did you think we had forgotten? Did you think we had forgiven? Behold now, the terrible vengeance of the Forsaken! Sylvanas. Death to the Scourge! And death to the Living! This is the hour of the Forsaken. We're finished. No escape for any of us. No, my beloved. Coralistras nods. They will not. Come to me, Oksana. Our fate is emblazoned upon our souls at birth. Bolvar's fall, while tragic, was unavoidable. All you can do now is honor your hero, Oksana. Collect Bolvar's shield from the field of battle and return it to your king. When you present the shield to Varian, tell him this. All is not lost. From the ashes of the fallen will rise a force that will unite the nations and purge the evil from this world. He mustn't lose faith. Go now, Oksana. Your people need a hero. They need you. My open hand will reward my friends, but let my enemies beware. King Rin brushes away a tear. King Rin nods. This is my fault. Never again will our kingdom be deceived. The Dragon Queen is right, Oksana. All is not lost. I will be the force that rises from the ashes, and I will purge the evil of the Horde from this world. The deaths of our brothers and sisters will not have been in vain. The Alliance will forge a new destiny for Azeroth. At the behest of Lady Proudmore, I will allow a diplomatic mission to Orgrimmar to question the Horde's war chief, Thrall. You will assist her in this journey and keep her safe from harm. Return to me with news from Orgrimmar. Speak to Jaina when you are ready to leave. Serve with honor. All I ever wanted was to study. Lady Proudmore, I'm ready to go to Orgrimmar. Please open a portal. Do not do anything that would incite the Horde. The War Chief has agreed to see us on good faith. Let's go. Oh, 
Necron, stand down. Jaina. Thrall, what has happened? The king is preparing for war. Jaina, what happened at the Wrath Gate? It was a betrayal from within. Lady Proudmoore, the War Chief speaks the truth. This subterfuge was set in motion by Vermathros and Grand Apothecary Putris. It was not the Horde's doing. As the combined Horde and Alliance forces began their assault upon the Wrath Gate, an uprising broke out in the Undercity. Vermathros and hordes of his demonic brethren attacked. Hundreds of my people were slain in the coup. I barely managed to escape with my life. The Horde has lost the Undercity. We now prepare to lay siege to the city and bring the perpetrators of this unforgivable crime to justice. If we are forced into a conflict, the Lich King will destroy our divided forces in Northrend. We will make this right, Jaina. Tell your king all that you have learned here. I will deliver this information to King Renthrall, but Bolvar was like a brother to him. In the King's absence, Bolvar kept the Alliance united. He found strength for our people in our darkest hours. He watched over Anduin, raising him as his own. I fear that the rage will consume him, Thrall. I remain hopeful that reason will prevail, but we must prepare for the worst. For war. Farewell, War Chief. I pray that the next time we meet, it will be as allies. Corcron, prepare transport to the Undercity. Loktar, friend, what is it you wish? The Horde does not want war, Draenei. Listen well. Loktar, friend, what is it you wish? Your champion, Bolvar, died in defense of our world. The Horde is saddened by the loss of such a great hero, but the Horde was not responsible for the cowardly attacks made by Putris at the Wrath Gate. We also have lost mighty heroes because of this betrayal. Tell your king we will do everything in our power to bring the perpetrators of this cowardly act to justice. We will do all that we can to avoid conflict with the Alliance, but we will not hesitate to defend ourselves if provoked. Stormwind is reborn. Fare you well. They have lost the Undercity? Then the time to strike is now. We will deal with Putris ourselves and retake the ruins of Lordaeron for the Alliance. Our struggles are far from over. I sent Brol and Valyria to the Undercity before you left for Orgrimmar. In fact, they're now stationed outside the sewer entrance to the ruins, awaiting orders. Lady Proudmore will open a portal to our forces outside the Undercity. Go there and report to Brol. Jaina and I will be close behind. Never again will our kingdom be deceived. I am listening. Who are you supposed to be? Varian said he'd send heroes. Asha Fela. Deep inside the bowels of the Undercity hides the assassin responsible for the deaths of Bolvar and our brave soldiers at the Wrathgate. Varian has brought the full might of the Alliance with him to assist in the takedown. Join him and Lady Proudmoore in the manhunt and earn your place amongst the greatest champions of the Alliance. Speak to King Varian Rin when you are ready. Goodbye. The line of Stormwind's kings has been restored. Reporting for duty, your majesty. Let the assault begin. Heroes of the Alliance, your king calls. Gather behind me at the entrance to the sewers. 
Hidden inside this defiled city is the wretch responsible for murdering our brothers and sisters at the Wrathgate. He must be brought to justice. The hour of redemption is close at hand! Prepare yourselves! The march upon the Undercity begins now. Be empowered by your king's strength. Follow me, heroes, for the glory of the Alliance. Onward, brothers and sisters. Destiny awaits. I Our descent into the depths of depravity begins. Be on guard. Jaina, lend us your strength. Right away, your majesty. Grand Apothecary Putris unleashes the engorged Blightworm. Soldiers fall in. Guard the halls. Your aberrations are no match for the Alliance, Putris. We're coming for you. here. There are corpses everywhere. The stench. Overwhelming. Horde. By the looks of the struggle, they're here in force. Somewhere. Stay alert and on guard. There's no telling what horrors are with us. Let them pass, minions! Kill them! My work must not be interrupted! The main chamber is this way. Let's go. There. 
There's nowhere to run, monster. Stare into the abyss and watch as it blackens your I souls! You are no match for my creations! This cannot be happening! It will not end like this! I've worked too hard! So many years! I... I will consume more energy! The power washes through me! I see everything! I hate resorting to violence. More suffering awaits! Justice is served. What say you now, Putris? Look around you, brothers and sisters. Open your eyes. Look at what they've done to our kingdom. How much longer will we allow these savages free reign in our world? I have seen the Horde's world. I've been inside their cities, inside their minds. I know what evil lies in the hearts of orcs. We are victorious! The Undercity belongs to the Horde once more! Loktar! Thrall, here. Onward, we end this now. Varian, stop! I won't help you do this. should all know. The orcs have a battle cry. Lok Tarogar. It means victory or death. Fitting. To the throne room! I was away for too long. My absence cost us the lives of some of our greatest heroes. Trashed like you. And this evil witch were allowed to roam free, unchecked. The time has come to make things right. To disband your treacherous kingdom of murderers and thieves. Putris was the first strike. Many more will come. I've waited a long time for this, though. For every time I was thrown into one of your damned arenas. For every time I killed a green-skinned aberration like you, I could think of only one thing. What our world could be without you and your twisted horde. It ends now, War Chief. Attack! May my aim be true. For Bolvar! For the Alliance! No! Stop! It did not have to be like this. Stormwind honors your service to the Alliance. The Alliance will forge a new destiny for Azeroth. For too long, the Horde has been left unchecked. We allowed their territories to prosper, and in return for our generosity, they plotted and planned our demise. Peace? Useless. It's gotten us nowhere. We have lost some of our greatest heroes to peace. Let us see what battle brings. Return to Northrend, Oksana. Conquer it for your king. For the Alliance! Thanks for watching! If you missed out on the first half of this tale, you can check it out in the video linked below. And while you're at it, don't forget to like and subscribe so you don't miss out on any future adventures. Safe travels until we meet next in the world of Warcraft.